Producer are staying with us, taking a live look outside on the CorwinAuto.com Valley Skycam. Lots of sunshine after a, a few gray days out there. It's nice to see the sun shining once again. The leaves continue to change on those trees. They're now well into October. Those leaves will continue to change and eventually fall on off. Temperatures right now with sunny skies, 57 degrees. Winds out of the north and northwest at 13 miles per hour. They'll continue northerly today around 5 to 15 miles per hour with perhaps an occasional stronger gust. 48 in Devil's Lake, also 48 up in Bedet, 51 in Bemidji, 57 in Wadena, 54 in Detroit Lakes. Just a few clouds out there off in the uh, Devil's Lake Basin and also in northern Minnesota. These will continue to slide off toward the east. These clouds likely to dissipate as we head through the next few hours. So we'll see some mostly sunny skies throughout much of the region and that'll warm us on up into the 50s up north and 60s in the central and south. With the uh, few clouds that we have out there, no precipitation falling out of any of those clouds. And we're looking for a dry day today. That will change as we go through time tomorrow, however. Right now in the northern plains, though, quiet. Not until you get down into western Nebraska, do you see a few showers in, some thunderstorms, and some of those reach back into southeastern portions of Wyoming. Also a few showers in southern uh, Idaho, northeastern portions of Nevada, parts of southern Utah, and Quite a bit of rain, shower, and thunderstorm activity down in parts of Arizona. The East Coast, quiet. All the rain that the South Carolina have, that upper level low, still slowly pulling away. But thankfully, all that rain that they did have to endure in South Carolina, even in parts of North Carolina, is now pulling off the coast. For us, as we head through the rest of the day today, again, we'll see a warm-up into the 50s up north and some 60s off towards the south. A pretty nice day out there with relatively light winds out of the north, 5 to 15 miles per hour. Overnight tonight with some clear skies, we're going to see temperatures dropping on off. Could see a touch of frost in a few areas as we head towards tomorrow morning with temperatures dipping into the 30s. And as we head through the day tomorrow, just a few clouds around to start off with, but we'll see increasing clouds as we head through the lot of portions of the day. And then here comes the rain late tomorrow in the form of some showers and some thunderstorms. Those will continue to slide off towards the east as we head through the evening hours and into tomorrow night. Some of this may linger into our eastern counties into Thursday morning. Over the next couple of days, today, nice. Tomorrow, not as nice. Increasing clouds without a chance for some showers and storms moving in. And again, some of that activity may linger into the early morning hours on your Thursday. Late Thursday, though, we could see a return to sunshine. Friday, a nice day. Mid-60s, Saturday and Sunday, they are looking rather nice. Temperatures in the low and mid-70s with partly to mostly sunny skies. And we cool down just a touch as we head into your Monday. And along with that, a chance for a few showers. Thank you, Robert. Mm -hmm. Straight ahead here at noon, hope and sadness mix as the search goes on for the crew of the sunken cargo ship El Faro. Storm Team.